the COVID-19 pandemic has retarded economic development across all sectors due to lockdowns and other measures set to fight COVID-19. Prime Minister Robina Nabanja says government is to enforce vaccination measures to ensure the country reopens by January, which is next week. Members go and vaccinate. We are going to enforce vaccination measures. That's all. Go and, and get vaccinated. She made the remarks at St. Andrea Kahwa Catholic Parish Kakumiro District. She says stakeholders have played their role of educating and sensitizing the masses about the COVID-19 pandemic and it is now upon them to act. We have to note that uh, I think we have suffered enough. We are going to open the economy. But as we open the economy, Ugandans must take, each one of us must be responsible for our own lives. Make sure when you go to church, you have a mask. Make sure you social distance. Make sure that you have some sanitize around you or wash your hands with soap. Omicron that has come transmits the same way a Delta variant was transmitting. And therefore, we request Ugandans to be more vigilant and responsible. Reverend Father Joaquin Mugisa, the parish priest, St. Andrea Kahwa Catholic Parish Kakumiro, expressed concern on the increasing corruption in the country. The clergyman encouraged parents to take their children to school once schools are cleared. The LC5 chairperson Joseph Sentai, Kakumiro District, said that during the accelerated vaccination period, Kakumiro has registered 67% of the people vaccinated and is optimistic that they will hit the target soon. For accelerated vaccination, the COVID-19, we have to understand you, 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 the resident district commissioner Kakumiro Major David Matovu asked Ugandans to embrace government programs for development. <laughs> Story by George Nyonzima for UBC News.